My family has a deep history in America. Our story was passed down through the generation to get to me. Family's story started with my great great grandfather, Samuel Wesley Sutton. I was named in his honor. He was a very important part of our family's history. His mother was an African slave, and his father was her white master. After the first Juneteenth, he was a part of the most successful black-owned enterprise known as the Grand Fountain of the United Order of True Reformers in Richmond, Virginia, where he grew up. During the years from 1881 to 1910, he had the first black-owned savings bank, a grocery store, a hotel, and a concert hall. Following in our grandpa Wesley's footstep, our family went on to have a similar impact. Here is my grandfather, Granddaddy Buster. He was the president of Texas chapter of the NAACP. He also ran and operated one of two of the first black-owned funeral homes in San Antonio, Texas. Please meet my great uncle, Percy Sutton. We call him Uncle Jimmy. During World War II, at the age of 21, Percy Sutton was a Tuskegee Airman. Red Tail Angels from 1941 to 1946. That was an all black squadron, and they never failed a mission. After the war, Percy Sutton went on to become a lawyer. He was Malcolm X's lawyer in 1960, until Malcolm's death in 1965. He also helped make the world famous Apollo Theater a national landmark. Finally, I am so proud to introduce my dad, Clinton R. Sutton, aka Chuck Sutton. He was born in 1950, and we lost him in 2009. My dad was a journalist, an editor, a political leader, and activist. He was best known as the television producer of It's Showtime at the Apollo, which aired from 1990 until 2004. He actually discovered Steve Harvey, who was the greatest host of the show for many years. I used to spend the night in hotel parking lots, and I said, come on, God, man, I've been trying to make this dream come true. You'd have left me out here like this. He said, hey, Steve, this is Chuck Sutton with Showtime at the Apollo. We saw a tape of you. You're very funny. If you could get here Sunday night, uh, we'd love to put you on television. Call me back, let me know if you can make it. My dad was so committed that even in his sick bed, he could produce a radiothon. It was a get out the vote effort that helped elect our first black president, Barack Obama. And our story continues. My name is Patrick Samuel Wesley Sutton, and I am proud to be part of my family's African-American legacy.